What do you build me up? Buttercup, baby, just to let me down And mess me around in the worst of all What is going on guys? We are at Thorny Park today and Evie just left his season pass in his car so we had to run all the way to Evie's car to get it but anyways I am excited for this visit and so Evie are you ready? Woo! Oh yeah! Okay, so we just both rode both Ferris wheel and Enterprise. Ben and I rode both rides to 10 out of 10, and there's Tommy the Red going over there. And so, anyways, Evie, what did you think of those two rides? Uh, I thought they were both good. I rate Ferris wheel 10 out of 10, got some good views on it, and Enterprise a good time. Oh, yeah! Okay, so we just rode Tilt Whirl right there, and I rate it a 10 out of 10. It was a really good first ride on it for the season. And so, Evie, what did you think of it? I'm going to give it an 8 because, I mean, we did get good spins out of it, but it there was a portion of the ride where we weren't spinning, so that was the downside. Oh, I forgot. I already forgot about it, Evie, so I'm glad you're reminding me. So, otherwise, I definitely would have rated it a 10 walking away from here today. And Okay, so we just rode Demon Drop, and I rated it a 10 out of 10. It was really good, and so, Evie, what did you think of it? Ah, uh, it was a really good ride on Demon Drop. Give it a 10. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we just rode Thunder Creek Mountain, and I rated it a 10 out of 10. I prepared pretty decent for it, and Evie and I were doing the Log Plume song for the first ever time. And so, Evie, what did you think of Thunder Creek Mountain? Ah, uh, it was a good ride. Um, I'll give it, uh, I'll give it a 10. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we just rode Zephyr, and I rated a 10 out of 10. It was really good, and we saw something really great. And so, Evie, what did you think of it? I give it a 10. Good ride. Oh, yeah. This is this close, sadly. Okay, so we just rode Steel Force, and I rated a 10 out of 10. It was really good. I got some crazy ejector airtime in the drop on the first big airtime hill, and on the Camelback Hills too. Steel Force was hauling today, in fact. We got some airtime throughout the whole ride, and so, Evie, what would you think of it? Uh, I thought it was really good. I uh, got some good airtime going over the Camelback Hills, the first drop. And all throughout the ride, it just provided great airtime. And yes, it was falling. I'll give it a 10. Oh, yeah! And for those of you wondering, they are cleaning the seats every, like, you know, so often to keep the train clean, to keep the guests safe. Okay, and so we just rode Thunderhawk in the front row, and I rate it a 10 out of 10. Thunderhawk is a front row ride, people. So if you ever go around to ride in Thunderhawk, be sure to go in the front seat. It is so smooth in the front row. And so, Evie, what did you think of Thunderhawk? Uh, I thought Thunderhawk was pretty good today. Uh, it definitely is a great front seat ride. I actually enjoyed those last uh, uh, three Camelback Hills back to the uh, break run. I thought those were pretty fun. So uh, give, it a, give it a 10. Oh, yeah! All right, so we just rode Music Express, and I rated it a 7 out of 10. It was a short ride cycle again, but it was funny because Evie here was doing some antics and uh, I'll show him right after I'm done sanitizing my hands here. Yeah, I can sanitize my hands while doing a vlog. It's amazing, guys! And so, Evie, what did you think of Music Express? Um, yeah, 
Yeah, I'm gonna have to give that ride. Uh, I'm gonna give it a six because it, it just wasn't. Well, yeah. It was too short. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we just wrote Dominator Red, and I rated it a ten out of ten. It was really good. And so, Evie, what did you think of that? I give it a ten. Oh yeah. What is going on, guys? We are waiting in Hydra right now, and our day's been really good so far but we've been waiting for this and stacking is not good because uh, there's capacity issues but i understand they are trying to promote social distancing though but capacity has been an issue with hydra today and so evie what do you think of this mm -hmm. i mean, I mean it's like annoying how capacity how they're i don't know it's just annoying i guess but at the same time it is understandable but i'm just trying to get on yeah okay so we just wrote hydra and I rated it an 8 out of 10. It was It's because of the capacity issues like I just mentioned. Uh, but it was overall a really good ride on Hydra. And so, Evie, what do you think of that? Yeah, I'm going to have to give that an 8 too. The ride was good itself, but um, at the same time, the line, it was just moving. It wasn't moving that quickly because, you know, um, they were blocking off some seats, which is understandable for social distancing. But, like, it was just like... I don't know, like the operations just weren't that fast I felt like, and I felt like we were there, uh, I don't know, for a decent amount of time, but other than that, good ride on Hydra. Oh yeah! Okay, so we just rode Thunder Canyon a little while, a little bit ago, and I rated it a 10 out of 10. It was a really crazy ride, despite all the having to wait and stuff, uh, because we got, I, got, oh, I got a decent amount of the waterfalls, and so did Evie, and that was a really good ride on Thunder Canyon. And afterwards, we were making all those antics, too. And so, Evie, what did you think of it? Oh, I thought we had a good ride on Thunder Canyon. Um, the waterfall definitely felt very, very refreshing. Um, it was really hot out today, so after getting off of that, it felt really good. So, uh, give it a 10. Yeah, this is the perfect end to the day because Talon almost seems like it's a walk-on. Um, okay, so we just rode Talon, and I rated it a 10 out of 10. It was really good. And so, Evie, what did you think of it? Uh, it was good. We sat in row 6. And um, I thought Tom was running pretty good today. I give it a 10. Oh, yeah. So this has been one great day here at Dorney Park. We were able to get on everything we wanted except for Sea Dragon and Cedar Creek Flyers because we were desperately wanting to get back on those. And so, Evie, how would you say today has been? Uh, today's been really good. Um, we were able to get on uh, the stuff we wanted to. It was good to get back on Thunder Canyon and Thunder Creek Mountain today. Um, Steel Force was really good today. That was my favorite coaster of the day today, and I'm happy that uh, this time that the weather held out for us to have a good visit. So I think today was a really, really good day. Yeah. What was your favorite part about the day in general? Um, I'd probably say when we got back on Thunder Canyon. That was that was really good. Yeah, it was really good. I like, and afterwards we felt so crazy. Like we felt. We felt like we were like crazy or something because it, it felt so good to get back on Thunder Canyon. And there's Larry Slinger's lighting package over there. And yeah.